control alt destroy the ultimate battle today is it possible in one decade be valued four times more than microsoft let's find out there are two things we need to create a microsoft killer one a larger team and two a larger office we now have the ability to hire our own support and marketing team and have two floors dedicated to the core team a new team will need a leader like Romeo into HR management will have a $1.3 million budget. Romeo will handle wages and complaints. And selecting all the chairs, we are going to hire 59 support and marketing staff. The teams are here and we're going to focus on getting Vector A released to the public. Then we can focus on a Windows killer. And oh boy, look at what some companies are making. It's 2005 and Vector 8 is released. Five star for bugs, five star for quality and four star because people know who we are. I'm going to order 4 million copies for $10.4 million. After a few months, Vector 8 went from 3.6 million to 7.2, but unfortunately it's starting to go downhill. But it is time to develop a new software. But first, coming to the top floor, we're going to need to install some large server racks. The first version is going to have all the one star features and will sell for about $120. And it's it's looking like we've got enough designers, programmers, and artists. Let's develop. As we go through multiple versions of the Windows Killer, by 2015, will we become more valuable than Microsoft? It's September and let's chuck a quick review and so far we're a 9.6 out of 10. Personally, I think that we need to release this by January 2007. And the first version of the Windows Killer is out. So nobody has a clue who we are, but the quality is four stars and the bugs are three. So the budget for our marketing is going to be $300,000 and we're going to order half a million copies for $1.3 million. After a few months, Windows Killer version 1 went from $3.2 million to $6.6 .6 million. And currently, we have 152,000 active users. So it's time for Windows Killer version 2. So this time, we're going to add some extra features on the system. We'll auto balance this out, and all we got to do is hit develop. So just like that, our beautiful team right here and here will be able to develop Windows Killer version 2. It's December, and it's time to release... Window Killer version 2. 5 star for the blending wedge, 5 star for quality, and 3 star because people know who we are. We're going to set a marketing budget of about $400,000 and we'll order about 600,000 copies for $1.5 million. And while we have an update going, let's take a look at how version 1 performed. From $3.2 million to a maximum of $8.6 million and it's slowly just been going down. But will version 2 do really well? Oh boy, in just three months, we have profited $42 million. And so far, we are making about $20 million a month. You guys know what time it is. It's time for version three. And this time, what are we going to put on it? Let's put some surround sound, plug and play. And I think system recovery. Let's auto balance this out and let's hit develop. The game thinks it's going to be taking four years to develop, but I think we can develop it in about two years. It's okay, guys. We've got about five years to go till 2015. And so far, our company is worth 580 million. So that means we're doing something right. 30 years ago, I started this company. And today, we're doing extremely well because it's 2010 and it's time to release Window Killer version 3. Four star for quality, three star for bugs, five star for bleeding the web. So we're going to have a $400,000 marketing budget and we're going to order about 3 million copies for $7.8 million. And of course, we need to get an update done. And after a few months, Window Killer version 3 has made $30.2 million to making $26 million to now leveling off at about $20 million now. So that means so far, our three versions here are doing incredibly well. So that means we're going in for the fourth version. 
again. And pretty much, I think everything is going to stay the same. But this time, we're just going to improve the quality. And it's that time to release Window Killer version 4. So how did we go? 4 star bugs, 5 star quality, and 5 star for the bleeding wedge. For this version, we're going to set an unlimited marketing budget. And we're going to order about 5 million copies for $13 million. And after 4 months, started strong at $59 million. And now we're averaging around $50 million a month. It's Christmas here at Dev Notion. But did we reach our goal of being valued four times more than Microsoft? If we take our total worth and divide it by Microsoft's valuation, we get close to being seven times more valuable than Microsoft. And as long as we keep growing our teams, maximizing the efficiency, and keep creating more versions, we are honestly gonna make them file for bankruptcy. Otherwise, guys, that's gonna be it for today's video. If you did go enjoy today's video, consider subscribing down below for more videos like this. And guys, I'll see you all in a new video soon.